man, oh man, these things look crazy. If you're not a fan of these or just the material wise and just if you switch sides on me, I'ma keep you on the outside Do a dive, baby, you can't take a single thing from mine I just wanna know where you at, baby, pick a side Why you sending stars, tell me not, go and pick a side If you switch sides on me, I'ma keep you on the outside Do a dive, baby, you can't take a single thing from mine I just wanna know where you at, baby, pick a side Why you sending stars, tell me not, go and pick a side as you know that I want ya If you pull up, run around, I'ma drop ya uh, City lanes always wanna go hey guys, guys, as you guys can see, holy moly So these are an early review, I guess you wanna call it Or should I say unrelease? One, one, whatever the case is These are the Strawberry Cough SBs. Uh, if you guys haven't seen them on, on the YouTube yet uh, These things are supposed to come out It was actually supposed to come out 420 but of course, we kind of had this whole pandemic thing been going on, so things have been pushed back. I actually heard rumors that these things have actually been canceled just because, you know, this whole, um, yeah, the cough in there, that's why they call it strawberry coughs. If you guys don't know about the strawberry coughs, of course, it, they, it's not about the whole pandemic. It's mainly mimicking about the whole sick of weed. Honestly, I wouldn't know. I don't smoke or do any stuff like that at all. I'm a good child. I have no idea. 420 what is that but anyways i want to give a big shout out to my boy andre white for letting me take a look at these things a little early he's like yo uh you want to check these things out i was like hell yeah i do so make sure you guys check him out on his instagram it's epic underscore s underscore he does you know he does a little reselling get some early pairs here and there all legit so i appreciate you bro thank you so much for letting me take a look at these things these things here these are crazy these are crazy if you're lucky enough to get some of these things it's just that the detail on the shoe and everything about it is just insane. The one thing I can always respect SBs about dude, with their theme shoes or just SBs in general is that they always tell like a crazy story. The details, the materials, it's always crazy about it. And it's, you know, everything about it is actually pretty freaking nice. I mean, you won't see these type of materials and this type of design and this look on any other shoe other than like SBs. That's why I feel like SBs has been like a crazy freaking hype this year. You guys already know, this is the SB year for sure. 100% like I, to me, I really can't get with, with it. And I, but trust me, I get it though. I get it. Get that it's really hyped up and I get that people really like it. And you know, the reselling these things is, is insane, especially on some other, SBs as well. You guys should already know we just got done with the whole Ben and Jerry's and we saw how that hype went. I feel like if these were to release, man, would these overtop the Ben and Jerry's? Probably not. I don't know. But now since they made it like unattainable and basically not even like have an official date, might even get canceled. These probably be worth more than the Ben and Jerry's now. Now I'm seeing prices around like that 3,000, 2,000 price, you know. That's probably because it's also not many pairs is around. Uh, like I said, it's unreleased. Only so many, like few people have them. So yeah, that's why they're super expensive. And but anyways, these are the SB High Dunks. And I do have the Dunk, I have one Dunk High in my collection. I have the Tiffany's. And I've always said that, man, watch out for the ankle right here because that will hurt. But with these things here, with that velvet material on the back, I think that you might be straight if you do decide to wear these. But this here, I'm not sure if you want to wear something like this, man. This is a masterpiece, like for real. This is like something crazy. But is this something for me that I would rock and that I would pay for personally? Probably not, to be honest. This is something that I wouldn't rock. I mean, I'm just going to keep it real. I already told you guys, I'm not an SB guy. I've never been. I like some SBs, that's for sure. I do, I like some SBs, I respect it. And I get it. But would I spend my hard earned money to pay for resale and do all the footwork to get these things? Probably not. I'm just gonna keep it 100. I don't know man, to me, $2,000, $3,000 for a pair of shoes is just a little too much for me. But, shoot man. Just the craziness about this looking shoe, man. I truly get it, man. I truly get it. 
But you know what, man? Let's go ahead. Enough of me talking. Let's just go ahead. Let's jump into this review real quick, huh? Full detail for with these things, man, because it's a lot of details to go around. Just check it out, man. These things are insane, guys. So just do a little quick little 360 on these things. And you guys already know I like to start off on the toe box as well. Let's look at the toe box here. You guys can see you got the whole preparation. And you got this like new buck suede material. It's actually pretty nice, man. Very soft. You can tell it's actually high quality stuff right here. Very, very nice. You got this tumble leather here on the side on the toe box as well and you guys can see a little seed popping out that mimic it, mimics the whole strawberry of course it looks you know a little bit of yellow dots in the little preparation and it does kind of lift up a little bit so it's not just dots there's like indention in the leather as well so you can just see all the details all around on the red leather you guys can see how it kind of preparation like the bumps is and everything just hit like the seed bumps on all the like you know like an actual strawberry and it's all throughout the red shoe even on the inner side as well to this nike swoosh here you get this green nike swoosh and you have that little hairy suede or nappy suede whatever you want to call it yes and it go, moves all the way on to the ankle part here as well you got this little nice little suede to it and right here you got the little logo here as you can see got that <clears throat> strawberry cough cough and that's kind of the reason why we're seeing why these things have been pushed back or probably even canceled just because you know we are in this pandemic you know people are losing their lives and everything so i don't want to be insensitive about that and i guess nike don't want to get insensitive about it either because coughing and everything and you know people getting sick you don't want to joke around with something like that and you know people should get it though if the point of it is not because people are getting sick the point is you know um when you smoke weed i hear that people cough so i heard and moving on to the ankle part here you got this like velvet material man check this thing out here it's actually pretty nice and you guys can see on the pull tab here it looks like a strawberry stem and you can't you know just to pull on the on the um, uh, hill tab here move on to your thick red flat rope laces and you have this like faded like yeah faded nylon tongue here as you guys can see it has a little bit of the red on the bottom fades all the way up to white and of course you have that nike sb dunk high pro tag on the top of the tongue here and in the inner sock liner you have this velvet material inside which is actually pretty dope and of course it does come with extra set of rope laces you got your looks like pink and a little bit of green you know keep on the theme of this whole strawberry look sb insole which is actually really cool man look at this you got the strawberry insole out wow got the strawberry logo the strawberry man the strawberry mouse mascot that's you know see him coughing got the red uh high eyes this design is actually really dope, man, for real. And of course, you got the SB on the on the insoles as well. So this is actually pretty crazy, man. The back of the tongue here, you got the little stash pocket here, man. Just in case you want to put your quarters or, um, yeah, I would say that if you want to hide like your money and nothing else in there that's provocative. Yep. Don't hide anything else in there. Now, move on the midsole, if you guys can see. You definitely had this see-through translucent midsole, all basically on the whole entire outsole, you guys can see. Look at, take a look at this here, man. You can see through it as well, man. And you have your little red stitch through the midsole, so these things are probably not going anywhere. Well, on the bottoms here, you have that outsole here. You got that SB outsole. You got the red and a little bit of the green translucent. It's basically almost, I feel like, like a cover almost but it's rubber little rubber little outsole here and these things are just just the details alone man i definitely respect it i definitely get it but man i just wish that sbs they tell such a great story but they make it so limited and so hard to get maybe that's why they make that's why these things feel so special because just the way how they release it man so i definitely get it man all right guys so there you guys have it these are the strawberry coughs uh nike sb highs you guys let me know what you guys think of these things here are you a fan of nike dunk highs or even lows i think a lot more people are a fan of lows i do like the highs too man these things are actually like i said they're pretty cool man they actually 
really really nice but like i said man i don't know if they're gonna release or not i mean they could do away with the with the actual guy when they officially release they could do away with the little guy here and then drop it like this maybe possibly but who really knows and if they do do like that obviously the ones with the, the mascot is going to be like worth way more this is definitely a collector's item for sure i never seen anything like these things man um i don't know how the hype is and everything is going to be once these things do get closer to release i'm also hearing like releases maybe july maybe sometime in the summer so if you want to hold your breath <clears throat> on that be my guess but if not it's one of those things, bro. So, shout out to my boy, Andre Wright. Thank you so much for uh, uh, letting me take a look at these things and actually doing a little review. So, make sure you guys follow him as well on his IG. So, if you need to get anything, uh, you know, whatever he's reselling, make sure you hit him up. He's actually a dope guy, legit and everything. So, uh, if you guys don't mind, please hit that thumbs up. Subscribe if it's your first time here. Comment down below and please hit that bell for all the notifications for when I do drop vids. Don't forget to follow me on all my social media at GermanChris on IG. Sometimes on Twitter, don't get Snapchat. Anyway, guys, appreciate y'all. Love y'all. I'm Jeremy Chris. Stay safe. Peace.